The pricing of airline tickets can seem like a mystery. The flight that was on sale for $150 yesterday is now $300, oh, and now it's back to $150. Then you may have paid twice as much for your ticket as the guy sitting next to you. What is that? This is Algorithmics, the space where we explore how invisible computer-controlled database sets of rules are making decisions for us every day. Airlines use dynamic pricing algorithms to set ticket prices, and price fluctuations as high as 50% can be common. Each airline uses different proprietary algorithms to set pricing variations, and they usually keep the details secret. But generally, as the flight gets closer, the demand for tickets rises and prices go up. Algorithms shift pricing automatically, sometimes on an hourly basis, and cheaper tickets are generally sold first, and last-minute tickets are often more pricey. If, say, a train derailment shuts down a major section of rail and thousands of stranded passengers suddenly book flights, the prices will surge in accordance with that sudden demand. But sometimes demand can weaken as a flight state approaches, and prices for the remaining seats will drop. So if lots of people search for the same flight route in a certain time period but don't ultimately buy tickets, prices could surge based on predicted demand and drop again when the purchases aren't actually made. Algorithms also mine data on historical prices of flights to determine patterns and predict demand for future flights. That's why no matter how early you book it, your Thanksgiving flights will probably cost you an arm and a leg. Hey, NBC News viewers. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.